spaceship go It's here. Well, here it is, the Skywatcher Evo Star 72ED, a doublet apochromatic refractor with a 72mm aperture and a 420mm focal length. No! Let's take a closer look at this puppy. First things first, um, the scope comes in this lovely foam padded Skywatch travel case. It comes with a spare key as well. Um, these foam inserts can be removed, so if you want to add accessories in there for transport, you can. Uh, the OTA itself comes with a removable drew shield. It comes off just like that. The dust cap is threaded. It is not a pull pop dust cap, so do bear that in mind. I uh, ripped the drew shield off completely my first time. Um, also, we have the industry standard uh, clamshell style tube rings. Um, comes with a piggyback camera mount adapter as well. Towards the back, we have our finder scope bracket, and on the business end, we have a 10 to 1 dual speed Crayford focuser. Well, how does it perform? Well, at 420mm focal length, you get a nice wide field of view, frames Carina nicely, which you'll see in a bit. Um, sitting at f5.8, it's not the fastest of scopes, but it's good enough for the big wide field targets. Two issues that I have with the scope. First being, the back focus is really short. So shooting prime with a DSLR, I had to add an extension tube of 30 mil to my two inch T-ring. Um, the second problem is this doesn't have a flat field. It's incredibly rounded around the edges. Um, there is a field flattener reducer available for this scope. Um, Bintel do sell one. I would say that if you were to purchase this scope, definitely invest in the field flattener. I will be investing in one. But alas, let's have a look at uh, a frame we pulled from last night. Now that frame was a single exposure in hydrogen alpha. It was three minutes long and shot at ISO 1600. The purpose of showing you this image was not to kind of portray the, the quality of a, a picture I can pull. It was more show as a, a reference of framing for the field of view you can achieve with this OTA. You'll definitely be seeing the results of a full imaging session coming from me with this scope. Um, I'm really excited to see the data that this thing can pull out. Now I'm not sponsored by them, but I'd like to give a massive shout out to the guys over at Bintel, the binocular and telescope store in Sydney. Um, if you're in Australia, they should be your one-stop shop for everything astro-related. Um, from CCDs, cool cameras, filters, OTAs, mounts, Bintel got you covered for everything. Um, we've got a fantastic team over there, excellent customer service. If you want to go check out their store, there's a link in the description down below. And as always, cheers, stay safe, and clear skies.